Hey, what's up, guys? Thanks for tuning in today. I'm totally geeking out if you can't see. Well, um, the reason I'm geeking out is that I have finally figured out what was going on with the Elgato. So if you've uh, looked at my channel, I have the Elgato unboxing. I have some tips on how to get it to work better with the sound capture software. Well, having tremendous issues up until yesterday, I have finally figured out the fix. Stay tuned to figure out what we did to get it working and to better your experience with the Elgato Sound Capture. So guys, as I said in the intro here, finally figured out what was going on with the Elgato Sound Capture, the, El the Elgato Game Capture card. So. Long story short, Elgato has sent out some pretty awesome updates to their sound capture device right here, as you can see. Um, the only issue is it doesn't really work with voice meter that well from what I found. Um, I had it linked in, you can see in my very first stream that I that is shared on Twitch. I have my, my Twitch channel below in the description. Take a look. You can hear that the game audio has a slight double echo behind it. The voice is great. Voice sounds great, but the game audio is an explosion. You got that little slight explosion sound right behind it. So I'm a firm believer of great audio, great video. Um, engaging content it needs to be it needs to sound great to for you guys because you're spending your, your time with us so that was the biggest annoyance I had with the Elgato is that for the first four months of having it I couldn't really get great sound because of the sound capture device so long story short this is what I did guys you can look at my other video and it has the old way I used to set it up but this is what I did my playback devices had the Elgato sound capture device here and it was set as a default okay simple I can come down to vo voice meter and make that a default it's my default right now I don't need to do that but the issue was it overran my playback device option so the Elgato sound capture was the default I could not select another device as a default it would select it for the single video I was watching on YouTube but if I reloaded the page, it would default right back to the Elgato sound. No matter what I did, I couldn't get it connected into voice meter here. As you see here, I played with the different outputs, inputs, could never get it quite working. When I did get it working, it always had that double echo. Volume was super high. It was just, it was a nightmare. So if you're running into this issue, simply put deactivate the Elgato sound capture in here and then copy my layout here copy this this layout right here so my microphone you use your microphone whatever microphone you have and then hardware output I have my HD audio second output this is my Turtle Beach headset it's crap but uh, in the A2 you select the HD60S. So that's what I use. It, it's uh, This screen is connected into the HD60S. And then I set here. The input is A. You, you, that's the sound that comes in from the game. It'll, it'll be playing right here. And then my voice is in B. So there we go. Um, if you copy this, it'll work. You can see in the game footage that it works perfectly fine. I will say this in the game footage you're about to see, my voice is kind of choppy. That's because I accidentally had, let me show you what I had. I accidentally had the automatically reduced game sound. If you do that, it, it cuts the game audio down and, and throws your voice a little higher. If you have that on, it'll get a g -g 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 sound. So um, I know I'm talking about the great audio, but if you listen to my voice in a couple parts of the video, you're going to hear that, uh, uh, that sound of the... Uh, software throwing my voice over the game audio so I would recommend deselecting this because it it makes it you sound like a robot at some point so that being said enjoy the game footage here okay guys this is the little test footage I'm putting together for you um, as you can see audio is coming through perfectly fine everything is looking great so far Really 
good. But... Yeah, this guy. Yeah, much better with this. Spot assist, spot assist, baby. Let's go. Okay, guys, there there you have it. I know you heard the little robot voice sounding there, but it wasn't anything to do with the uh, the setup I have. It was that, that pesky little option that I just showed you here, the automatically reduced game sound. Take that off. All your weird robot voice sounds are a thing of the past. So copy this setup. Let me know if it helps. Um, if you know a way of linking sound capture to voice meter let me know i'm definitely down for understanding new ways to do things i thought the sound capture software was awesome that being said i hope this helped not trying to make this a huge long tutorial for you i just know that it annoyed me and i want this to be out there for you guys if you're having trouble so comment below let me know what you liked what you disliked uh let me know if it helped thumbs up thumbs down give me feedback guys i appreciate it hey guys this is Nate with Adams Entertainment. Thank you for sitting back and watching the tutorial on the new updates. We appreciate your love and support. Thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you next time. Remember, stay uncommon and keep being you. See you guys.